What's up, my name is Geeks, Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, we are going to talk about Ticket Symbol QC, Quantum Skip. So this is a, a startup company that uh, produces batteries for electric vehicles, and they are claiming that the battery has some things that all these other current batteries for electric vehicles don't have, which we're gonna examine in today's video. So the company actually went public through a reverse merger and started trading on the NASDAQ as far back as last Friday. So if you type the ticket symbol QC, you should see them come up. So I wanna cover the stock and see the potential and the claims that they're making that if, if these claims are true, and then this stock is one that you wanna put in your portfolio right now and just lock it there, don't touch it and just let it ride uh, for the foreseeable future but before we get started guys if you're new to the channel we talk about how to earn money how to save money how to invest and build wealth so if that's something that interests you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content so again this company i'm talking about quantum scape uh started trading last friday uh, made some good moves and so far the technology and every the research that I've done about the company uh, if this technology holds and it comes out and prove it boy we are on to something here so let's jump right in take a look at the company talk a little bit about the the, the product that they have and why we think there is a a really big upside uh, to the company. So it's Jordan Martin. So again, this is a company, Quantum Scape. Uh, here is what these guys are claiming. Again, they, they, they produce batteries for electric vehicles. They don't produce electric vehicles, just so you know, they are working solely on battery and their battery is termed a solid state battery that works so you can see it here so let's go down i'm going to show you some of the claims that these they are talking about that your battery would do so uh they're saying that the battery uh has it would hold more energy uh, number two is that it can charge a lot faster number three that the lifespan of the battery uh is longer than the current um, electric vehicle batteries it's safer and it's cost effective so those are five major claims that if these guys can prove it and then i guarantee you that all the other electric manufacturers are going to want to either use their battery or copy this technology and start using it so this is groundbreaking and so yeah let's just jump right in and this is one thing i want to show you but before we go into their investor presentation this is where the stock is currently trading right now uh on robin hood so if you go one week back which again is not that far um you can see as of um last friday the stock was at 35 and then kind of spike all the way to um all the way to $46 today uh pre-market pullback and then right now it's sitting somewhere uh, let's see, somewhere about $46.65. So again, that is just for a, a day and a half trading uh, on, the, uh, on the NASDAQ. So don't take this. This is just the beginning for this stock if it holds. Again, that's the caveat there, if it holds. If their technology comes out to be true. So most important things, again, this is uh, you know, how they're describing that the technology holds more energy. So you can see here on this chart, they, they're saying that traditional um, batteries right now or conventional batteries which are lithium ion batteries uh, have reached, they've, they've reached a limit and the lithium metal batteries which is what they are working on it gives it an extra range uh, for holding energy and also making it cheaper to produce so I, I mean to me I, I think these claims are still yet to be proven because they haven't started manufacturing um, as of when I was reading this they, they, they're looking at maybe start going into production by 2025 um, they have key major uh, investors Volkswagen being one of the number one because even Volkswagen wants to use these batteries in their cars by 2025 so that's when they plan on really started uh, going in, in production so again to me if all these claims are true so you can can see here again let's just go over some of these claims that they are saying here that you know it holds more energy uh it, it charges faster you no know, it's about enables 15 minute fast charge which is so you go from zero to 80 percent in like 15 minutes that is crazy because i mean think about it it's like you pull up at the gas station uh for, to charge a car in this case you plug it 15 minutes you get about 80 percent fully charged that you can go and then it lowers your cost which to me i think that's something that a lot of car manufacturers will want to take a look at because 
Obviously, the battery is one of the most expensive things with these electric cars. The fact that you can lower the cost means the, the, the price of the cars are going to go down, which means more, more people are going to feel comfortable to start consuming and buying these electric vehicles because cost is always an issue. And then the lifespan of the battery, they're saying that it increases the lifespan of the battery. So let's say uh, Tesla is talking about the million mile battery. So if these guys can increase the lifespan, say it can go to like 2 million, 3 million, Boy, this is a, basically something that you want to keep your eye on. Um, and then say it's uh, relatively safer compared to the conventional batteries that are used in electric vehicles. So those to me, I, again, I'm going to repeat this. This is a major claims that if these things come out true, uh, boy, I'm super excited about this stock. Again, on the caveat that if it comes out true. This is the Volkswagen group that has made a ton of commitment to this technology. So look at, they have over 300 million plus in, in terms of funding, which is excellent. And so, I mean, everything about this company to me looks like it's headed in the right direction. They have people on their board that are from Tesla. And, and I'm like, hey, if somebody leaves Tesla and come and join these guys, I don't think they're just joining because they want to put their name out there. I think they're joining because they see uh, a huge potential here. So uh, before we actually conclude here, guys, I am looking at this company from the perspective of the fact that it's groundbreaking. This is what you call high risk, high reward kind of stock. Because um, if this thing turns out not to be true, this could be the next Terranol, right? But Terranol said they can, you know, you can prick your finger and do a run over 200 tests. That never happened. People invested in the company and it fell flat. So if, if that's the case, these claims that the guys are making, if these claims are true, boy, you should really sit back and, and relax. Full disclosure, I, I own shares of this stock right now in my portfolio. And my goal is to keep adding to, I want to get to a certain number that makes me feel comfortable. So um, if you want to invest in it, again, do your own research. Make sure that you, uh, you know, really read their presentation, which if you want, I'm going to put it. A link in the description below so that you can definitely go go check it out and actually uh, read but uh, in conclusion when you make claims like this with top companies and and all these other companies that are car manufacturers out there then they're not challenging you that means you're up to something because if these claims are just out there and Tesla could challenge them and be like that's not possible because Tesla is working on the million mile battery um, so if these guys are coming out with something that's new, I think um, Tesla can learn from them and that's why a lot of people are not challenging them. I'm not saying that maybe they're just waiting for the right time to challenge the technology, but as of right now, it looks like it's headed in the right direction. And again, their production line is not anytime soon. Um, they're looking at going into production and start really using these batteries in the car. Their timeline is maybe 2025 based on uh, the presentation that I saw. So you should be very, very careful. Again, with this, in, in my opinion, um, it's a high risk, high reward. If you want to jump in the stock, yes, this will be a good time to get in and just see where it goes from there. But uh, I see that the future is bright with this company, um, in my personal opinion. I, I like seeing new uh, technology innovation, taking it to the next level, which most people um, are not comfortable with. They want to see very established companies. That's my personal approach to this. So uh, let me know in the comment section what you guys think about QC. Do you think, oh, maybe this is just another uh, a target that uh, Citron is going to go after here pretty soon and prove this thing wrong or you see some potential there and hey, you know, maybe an opportunity to make a ton of money if you get in early. Let me know in the comment section. Again, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. And also, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo is currently doing a promotion where if you sign up and actually deposit $100, you get two free stocks to get you started. Links in the description below. You get a free stock, I get a free stock. That's what helps me continue to keep the content going on here on the channel. And as always, guys, always do your homework Work, don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated.